Jessie's stubborn. Um, she's hairy and drooly. In their six and a half years together at the Jeffco Sheriff's Office, this pair has become inseparable. She likes to just be on her own. She doesn't like anybody near her patrol car. Um, <laughs> she's her own thing. <laughs> Good girl. On Tuesday, they were on a routine call assisting another agency in Wyoming when they got a different call. A 12-year-old girl had gone missing the night before, and they jumped right in to help. We had a good starting point. It was away from her house, um, collected a Senate article from her bedroom, and went where we last saw her on video. From there, Deputy Fossler says Jessie was on a mission to find her. She even braved 90-degree weather and a cactus field. She worked through all the cactus, and I was pulling them out of her feet and her nose and her lips as we're going. They eventually landed at a home in the area, and with a nudge, Jessie pulled her around back. I, I was wondering why she wanted to go up to this house so bad, and I thought it was because of the dog that was playing outside. I thought it was because the kids were out there, but it wasn't. It's because this little human that we were looking for was... 50 yards or 20 yards behind the house. And she says finding that little human changed her life. I'm also a mom of a child about that same age, and she was obviously alone and afraid all night long. So finding her sitting behind a bush and just almost, you could tell she was like happy somebody found her. Just, it was awesome. Everything came out just perfect.